All right, Haley, are you ready? Yeah! All right. Hi, boys and girls. It's Miss Rebecca and Haley. We miss you so much. First, we just want to say that we love you, and we hope that you're having fun at home. And even though we can't see you, right, Haley, we can't see you. We miss seeing your smiles. We're so happy that you can see us and we can communicate through this video with with our videos of reading books and doing science experiments. You are so So Haley and I look Haley, we're gonna we're gonna be talking today about sink or float. So we have some objects. Haley, we have a dice. What what block what um object is this? Black. A block. What object is this? A book. Very good. And what object is this? A marker. A marker. And what object is this? A fork. Is it a fork or a spoon? A fork. You're being silly. We know this is a spoon. All right, very good, Haley. High five. Very good. Okay. So now we know what our objects are for our sink and float. We're going to make some predictions. Do you know what predictions means? Yeah. Yes. Haley knows that prediction means an educated guess. So we're going to think to ourselves and we're going to make a guess on what we think is going to happen. When we go, when we put the object in the water. Okay, Haley. So if it's going to sink, if we think it's going to sink, we're going to put a red X. Okay, a red X. And if we think it's going to float, Haley, are you ready? Yeah. To decide? Yeah. We're going to do a, a green star. Okay, so Haley, do you think this is going to sink or float? Float. Float. Okay, she says float, so I'm going to do a green star. Don't do it yet. Don't do it yet. Oh, you're so close. Okay. <gasps> Very that, good. That was so close. That was so close. We've got to do all of our predictions first. We're going to guess each one. Do you think that the block is going to sink or float? Float. Float? Okay, so Haley thinks... the diamond. Oh, I got it. Okay, so she thinks the block is going to float, so we're going to do a green star. Do you think that the ball is going to sink or float? <laughs> Float? Okay, not yet? Oh, you can't wait. You're yeah, so that good. Was, that was so close. That was so close. Okay, Haley, remember, if you think it's going to sink, if you think it's going to go all the way to the bottom, then we're going to do a red X if you think it's going to sink. Okay, do you think the marker is going to sink or float? Float. Float. Okay, so far we have everything Mascot floating. Toodles. Mascot toodles. Mascot. Okay, maybe if you hold it, Haley, feel this. Do you think that the spoon is going to sink or float? Float. You think it's going to float? Yeah. Are you sure you don't think it's going to sink? You, you want to guess everything is going to float? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so Haley thinks everything's going to float. Okay, what do you think at home? Do you think that the spoon is going to sink or float? So we have no red X's. We don't have, you don't think anything's going to sink? No, okay. Okay, so now's the fun part. We're going to test. We're going to see what the results are, okay? So, so Haley thinks everything is going to sink. Everything is going to float. That's what you think, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. All right, so our first object is a dice. So Haley, can you drop the dice in the water? And we're going to see oh. if it sinks or floats. Okay. What happened? A float. Um, it... Sink. It's it's right. It went down. It sank all the way to the bottom. Okay. Oh, we did. Oh, that's not part of the the objects. The next object. Okay. So we had we guessed it was gonna float, but it sank. Okay. So that means it's 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 very um dense. It has a high density. Remember we talked about density. It's very heavy. Okay, next is the block. Let's see, no, is the block going to sink or float? Float. Okay, let's check. Oh, did it float or sink? I'm float. That's right, it floated, just like you said. You said you think it's going to float, and it did. Okay, next is the, you want to do the, the ball next? Yeah. Okay. What happened? Did it sink or float? Sink. Did it sink at the bottom, or is it floating at the top? I'm floating on the top. It's floating at the top. Look, Haley, you got that one. You guessed it right. You did your prediction right. Okay, next is the marker. Does the marker sink or did it float at the top? Float at the top. That's right. The marker is floating. No, wow, no, very good. Floated. Now the spoon. Oh, did the spoon sink or float? Sink. Yeah, that's a big spoon. It did. The spoon. So look, you said you thought it was going to float. 
but it actually sank. So you can see, so what, what um, sank to the bottom? What is on the bottom? The dice and the... Ooh. That's right. And what objects are at the top because they floated? Look at, what's this? The marker, the block, and the ball. Those objects floated. It looks like Haley was surprised with the dice and the spoon because those had a high density. They were very heavy and they went to the very bottom. And the other objects were very light and they floated at the top. So boys and girls, this is a little lesson about sink or float. And if you want at your home, you can find some objects and make some predictions and think if you think it's going to sink or float. And then you can see if you're right. So this is something fun that we did today with just household objects. And do you have anything else you want to say, Haley? What would you like to say? <laughs> Was this a fun experiment? <laughs> yes. Oh, Haley, we got to sit. That's right. Okay, well, we had so much fun talking about sink um, or float with you, doing this experiment and seeing, seeing if objects sink or float in water. And we're looking forward to seeing you again soon. All right, do you want to do some more 